Hello everyone and welcome to a getting started video with iMindMap 10. Now we're going to show Windows and Mac for this tutorial um, but first things first let's get to the website so you're going to want to enter iMindMap into your browser iMindMap.com and this will bring you to the iMindMap homepage. Now click the MindMap software button and you'll be presented with this page where you're going to want to click download now which will take you to the download page. Here you can choose between Windows and Mac. We'll show the Mac version after. For now, we'll go with Windows and we're going to go ahead and download that. Obviously, download speeds are going to vary depending on your computer, your setup. We're just going to go skip that, open up the file that we downloaded. I'm doing it through Google Chrome itself and start the installation. So choose your language and it'll bring you to the wizard. Now hit next. Uh, choose this place, choose the place that you want to store the file, click next again, and then you want to hit install. This will begin the installation process, just like the download speed, this will vary depending on your computer. I've sped this up just so we can get through it nice and quickly. And once that's done, hit run iMindMap 10. So go ahead and accept the uh, license agreement by hitting agree and then you'll be asked to enter your serial number. So you can start with a free trial if you like, but we're going to show you how to enter the serial number. You can also activate by using your iMindMap account if you already have a serial number attached. So we're going to enter the serial number in, hit continue, and there we go. iMindMap has been activated. Just press continue to begin. And then iMindMap 10 will begin booting. Choose your language. And after a little bit of time, iMindMap 10 will open and you can begin using the software as normal. You've got your four views here, you've got Capture, Brainstorm, Mind Map, and Time Map. We're just going to go ahead, quickly open up a Mind Map, choose a central idea. Uh, I'm just going to pick that one, hit Start, and we'll name that Mind Maps. And there you go, you're away with your first map. Simple as that. So now we'll flip over and we'll show you how to do this on a Mac. Now, same process as to get into the website. We're going to go click to download. It's just the installation that's different. You get a .dmg. Uh, go ahead and open that and drag it into your Applications folder. Uh, holding it over the Applications folder for a while will actually open it in Finder. So you can clearly see that it's installing in there. Uh, and once that's done, you can very easily and very quickly just open that up. Uh, go ahead and click open. And iMindMap 10 will begin to run. So the installation is usually a lot faster on a Mac than it is on a Windows. So just like the Windows version, once you've accepted the license agreement, you'll be asked to enter your serial number in a screen like this. So we're going to click I have a serial number. And once that's done, you can either activate using your iMindMap account or using your serial number. Again, just the same as Windows. So we're going to enter in a serial number here, click Continue, and iMindMap has been activated. Uh, and choose your language. And iMindMap 10 is open. The same views, all the same. Fast Capture, Brainstorm, MindMap, and Time Map. And if we go ahead, open up a mind map. The presentation is slightly different, of course, uh, since it fits the uh, Mac interface a lot better. Uh, but the usability and the functions are all the same. And there we are. That's your getting started video. Uh, see you next time.